Chickens, it is Thursday already, but I just wanted to chat through something real quick. How is everybody doing today? Hope you all got out, got your running, and now you're ready to take on the day. Look, so yesterday somebody, I was talking to someone, one of my Phoebe kids, and they were saying how I look tired when I was out the day before, and um, they were like, wow, Phoebe looks so tired. That's why I'm out here. That, that's the reason why I chose to come out here. I come out here because I don't want you to think that, oh, because I'm tired, I can't do it. Oh, because I, I, oh, I worked last night and I, and I did this and I'm, I'm struggling with this and I'm struggling with that so I can't make it. I did this because I want you to push past that. I want you to push past that. Hey, sometime I'm gonna come out here without stupid wig. I'm gonna come out here with my real self because guess what? Your real self, your real self is what's inside of you. You gotta catch this. Your real you is the person inside of you. You hear me? And that, will bring out the real you on the outside. So it doesn't matter how you put on, you add on, whatever you change. Let me tell you something. If you're not 100% inside, if you're not 100% real, 100% authentic inside, then there's no reason for you to come out and put on a show. Because a lot of people come out in their makeup. I put, I put lipstick on this morning because I wanna say to you that, hey, I don't have to put nothing on to come out here to say that, hey, I'm changing mindsets. I'm changing your thought process. I'm changing the way how we see things because our eyes are like that. They are made like that for us to see, just see what's there. But God is saying, there's so much more on the inside, the love, the joy, the peace that's on the inside that you should always tap into to bring it out so it can be on the outside. Look, don't worry about my facial, my outer appearance. Don't worry about my outer appearance. I want to tell the person who is going through a deep mental illness. I want to tell the person who is going through cancer. I want to tell the person who is struggling through the, a diabetic Coma. I want to tell the person who is going struggling with drugs. I want to tell the person who is going to take the cocaine even right now and lay in that pool of water to commit suicide. I want to tell the person right now. I want to tell the person right now who doesn't have no hope that, hey, the moment you shut down the critics, you have to shut the critics down. You have to shut down the I can't, the I'm a failure, the I won't make it. Stuff like those. You have to shut them down. And you have to push out here like I do. And get up in the mornings or get up whatever time of the day you want to get up. The best time of the day to do this is in the evening and in the morning. Walk it out. Walk it out. Have a conversation with God. He'll change your mindset. He'll change your trap, cha ah, your thought process. So look, beloved. Don't worry about Phoebe out here without a wig because one morning I'd pop that wig off because y'all don't know, but I don't care about no, no wig. I don't care about no outer appearance. Yes, I'll, I'll do it for do it's sake because I'm in the world, but I'm not of the world. I'm in the world, but I'm not of the world. So every now and then, you got to understand if you know who you are, if you know whose you are, if you know your why, then you won't have a problem. What motivates you? God bless you. Have a blessed, have a blessed Thursday.